Welcome one more time to Seagull Running Your Channel today from Dover, UK with one thing really short and really important How is the weather in your area guys? It's too hot, too cold, what is the season there? I don't know where are you from, in which part of the world are you running? Let me know in the comments I'm gonna talk today about the hot weather and the precautions and cares you need to have when you're running in this weather Look nice, looks windy, looks fresh, but terrible Don't move here we go again, seagull running. Guys, first of all, like always, if you like the video, please subscribe, like, share, comment, anything you like. Feel free to tell me what do you think and what should I do to improve? Should I stop to do videos? Should I speak in another language? You don't like my English anyway. Say everything you want. Today, from Dover, looks really nice. 18 degrees, eight o'clock in the morning. I just finished 10 kilometers non-stop. I'm preparing for my first race in 616 days. London Half London Marathon. Sorry, London Half Marathon. I wish to do the London Marathon. So I need to move this one because like you said, like you can see, totally wet. And I'm, I'm preparing my, my training and everything. It's really, really hot. These days in Dover it's been really, really hot. The temperature is wearing really high. You can say, ah, but you guys are from Chile. You are from Brazil. You're supposed to be, get, you're supposed to get used to with this weather, guys. I left Brazil in 2009. I used to live there with 37, 36, normal. 32, 30, in winter 25. And I was perfectly fine. Sweating like an animal, but I was perfectly fine. Now, yesterday with 22 I was dying. It's because after 12 years living in England, my body changed, adapt, and well, it's the way we are. Uh, precautions, guys, we need to be careful with your hydration with your water. Today I didn't mean water because I was coming for a short run and I live really close here. But usually when I go, I carry my bag with some gels, something to eat after the run and water. Always water. You need to be careful with what you're drinking. And another thing really important, don't drink only water because when you're sweating, like this, you're losing a lot of salt in your sweat and you're losing minerals. And if you have only water, you're not recovering the minerals. You're just doing the hydration normally in your body, but you need to recover the minerals. Your body's gonna get weak. And if you drink too much water, your blood is gonna be weak and you can pass out, guys. This is something like really, really usual to happen when you run so much and you post your body and a really, really like intense training and intense effort. Keep an eye on that. And um, well, guys, always be careful with your clothes. Don't go with black clothes. This is too sunny because absorb the sun too much. You're gonna, your body's gonna be overheating and it's really dangerous especially if you're running alone if you're running with someone can see you like you're quite dizzy it's going to give you some water it's going to give you some advice they're going to stop they're going to mention something but when you run alone you feel like you're a superhero you feel like nothing is going to stop you you can do whatever you want and in the end it's, it's even dangerous i'm running here alone because i don't have nobody to run with me here um, this is a sad moment i'm going to put a sad music <laughs> but uh, i get used to that i'm happy with that not totally happy, we'd love to have a, a running partner, but it's the way. Guys, short video today, just to remind you, keep hydrated, drink a lot of water. When you arrive home, do your stretching, water, rest, relax. Important, stretch your legs and not stop your running straight away after complete. The time to stop, 10 kilometers, stop and sit. No, never do that because your body keep moving and your body is like a car. You cannot stop straight away like if you are in a, in a traffic light. You need to stop, stop, slowly, 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 keep working till your body get used to, till your heart rate goes normal, and then you can stop and rest and eat, etc. Et Guys, keep an eye on your training, keep an eye on your health. It's super important. Your body is your temple and you need to look after it. From Dover, UK today, seagull running to the wall. Not so hot today, a little bit windy. Hopefully you're gonna listen to me properly. If you like the video, please like, subscribe, share, comment, anything you want. I'm here for you guys. See the next one.